Hey everyone and welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn. On this video, we're going to be doing the errand, a secret share. So this one we pick up right outside of Song's Edge. So let's go ahead and fast travel there. Maria said to find her friend, the rock painter. Seems the paintings mean a lot to the Banuk. Okay, so we're going this way just outside of town. At these, like, uh, spring things over here, these little pools. Outland, wait, wait a moment. That weapon of yours, Outlander, that spear, I can see the blue light upon it. This? It was made by an acquaintance of mine. Ah. A shaman? Uh, no. More of a tinker? A tinker does not understand the spark in the metal, the song in the metal like this. But it could be improved upon, modified with the help of the old ones. Far north of here there is a cave, a shaft in the snow. Within it is a nest of metal birds. Find a bird that hasn't been stripped by shaman's past, Look for a rail inside it, the length of your spear. That's all I can tell you. Get a rail from some metal birds in a cave. Sounds perfectly normal. New errand, a secret shared. A Banuk shaman tells Aloy of a cave in the far north, used by the shamans for materials to craft their spears. Uh, find a rail part. Okay, um, so it's gonna send us way to the north. And we could fast travel to the dam, but then I'd have to climb up that hill, so I think I'm gonna fast travel to here. All right, we need a mount. Oh, he is not controlling well. Ooh, look at that, some Glenhawks. Dude, mount, what are you doing? There we go. That Glenhawk is right there. Well, we're just gonna pass right on by. Damn. Don't think he'll be able to keep up. We'll see. Yeah, no problem. So there's the dam. We're going over the top. Get some medicine here. No, that's not what I wanted to do. There we go, and then inside of this building we can get some data points. Inspection failed. Security inspection. This place, as my father used to say, is a six alarm dumpster fire. A catastrophic breach waiting to happen. And this Malinowski guy, he's the source of the problem. I guarantee it. Too wrapped up in this pet project of his. I mean, who the hell cares if a bunch of stagnant pools of water are rainbow colored or not? Proposal approved. Sylvester Malinowski, personal log 41. Data corrupted. Approved my chromatic preservation proposal. Blevins is furious, of course, but any expenditure that doesn't directly benefit his security team makes him furious, so it's hard to work up the energy to care. In any case, I think we're a go. Now if I'm right, with some relatively minor tweaks to the bacterial and pH contents, or contents of the springs, we should be able to cool them down without losing any of the coloration that makes them so special. The water at the centers of the pools should remain entirely sterile, 
and the cyanobacteria at the edges ought to have the exact same photosynthetic reaction. This is a real win. I mean, there will come a day when this park is open to people again. I have to believe that. And when it is, those people will want to see the prismatic springs. You know, it occurs to me, when all this is said and done, you'll be able to swim right through those springs. It'll be like taking a warm bath. Okay, back on the mount. We still have 750 feet to go. Just saw some Banook. Alright, so here we want to be careful. There's a control tower in there. And we're gonna sneak in. Now there are some nasties in there, and with the control p tower up, any of the harder enemies become basically impossible. You can't really kill them, because they just regenerate faster than you can damage them. So we need to get that tower overridden right away. Now there might be a watcher or some of those scrappers nearby. We can kill them with the silent strike, but anything else probably going to be too tough. Let's see, there's the tower. Oh, and there's a watcher right there. Let's take him out. Got him. Alright, so you can see there's some stalkers about. You can see their mines. Hopefully, we can override this before they see me. Uh oh, there's one right there. Crap, hurry up! Okay, then. Let's see if this thing can. Alright, that's gonna stun him. We can go do some damage to him. Ow! Ow! Hurry! Oh, the Banuka here! I've never gotten help before. Well, this'll be interesting. Let's see, we want ice bomb things and we want some tear blast. There we go, got rid of his gun, I think. Oh! Now, you gotta watch out, once you're, if you have a shield thing, once it's gone, these guys can totally one shot you. At least on ultra hard. Uh, not to be underestimated. Right, he is gone. Let's see, we should go back to Tear Blast. Oh wait, that's a Scrapper. I thought that was another... I thought that was another Stalker. Where's this Stalker? Oh, there he is. Whoops, didn't pull back far enough. Alright, his gun's gone, that's what I'm worried about. It's pretty fortunate those Banook came by. This control tower by itself can be pretty nasty. Or by yourself, rather. Can't see it. There we go. Alright, we got some scrappers. Oh, hi! Not expecting you to jump that far. Let's see, what do we want to do here? Maybe just a big spear hit? There we go. Big spear! Boom! Alright. Get never. Not too bad. Uh oh. Well, if they engage, I'll help them. Actually, there's really no reason. And they're leaving anyway. Let's just go inside where you can't see me. 
Oh. Uh, yeah, if they want to be crazy and do that, that's fine. They can go have fun. We found animal figurine one. Uh, depicts a stout antlered animal. Inscribed one of seven in a commemorative set, circa 2042, Montana Recreations. A recreation. Okay, and I think that's it. Okay. Got a mine there, or not a mine, but a signal thingy. Well, we're out of here. Is that my mount over there? Nope, that was something else. Alright, so we are going this way. That's some medicine, I'll take it. Hey, don't get off. I'm supposed to grab from the mount. What is this? Oh, uh, let's see, I'm going that way. Hold on, I'm turned around. I guess we, okay, right here. Don't feel like fighting, I'm out of here. Must be the cave that shot into the ground. Long way down. And not natural either. Must be some company. Where's one of the metal birds? Well, we got health down here, and we're back up to full. We got some blue gleam. Examine rail guide. Something's been hacked out of it. Maybe I can find another of these flying machines. Full health potion, very nice. Regular health potion. Alright, so we need to climb up here. And then up here. Activate tonsil. I could check my focus, see what it sees. Huh. Not so grounded after all. Now I can get across. Okay, over here we have animal figurine five. That one right there. And it's a deer. Go up. There's the door lock. I'll need to configure it. Hollow or hollow lock reset. If those punk technicians think I'm gonna sleep on them waltzing in here and screwing around with the drone routines, <laughs> they have seriously underestimated my sense of mission. Let's just reset that hollow lock. Echo Sierra Echo. Okay, we need right, down, right. The 
This will come in handy. I understand, Mr. Blevins. I didn't ask for a bunch of flying cameras. I need security, not surveillance. And security means firepower. As God is my witness, I will not be caught squirting blanks if and when a major act of terrorism desecrates these facilities. No one's touched this machine since it got sealed in here. Ban him! To Kenny Chow from Harris Bonner. Subject, ban him. Kenny, I get it, okay? I really do. Pharaoh is Firebreak's patron. Blevins is Pharaoh's lapdog. Circle of ass kissing. Blah, blah, blah. But if you allow Blevins to remain on site, Installation is going to take twice as long as we're budgeted for, and I don't know how deep Firebreak's pockets are, but I can guarantee you they're not bottomless. We've just got done recalibrating the entire fleet. The entire fleet, Kenny. Why? I imagine you're wondering? Oh, Kenny, I'm so glad you hypothetically asked. Blevins was unhappy with the baseline behavioral routines of the security drones. You know, the ones he selected himself. Not aggressive enough, he said. I doubt a Rottweiler mounted on an ICBM would be aggressive enough for him. So we patched in some combat behaviors, which, let me tell you, was not easy. Basically outfitted these things for war. Think about that, Kenny. Bleeding edge combat drones patrolling an empty wilderness. Also Blevins can play army on Firebreak's dime. I'm begging you, Kenny. Find a way to bar him from the hangar. Please. Harris. Alright, where is the thingy? I should be able to loot it. Ah, right here. Examine mounting rail. Shouldn't be hard to remove. I'll show it to that shaman when I'm back in Song's Edge. Alright. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna need Tear Blast. And Ice Thingies. We have a friend. Uh-oh. Ow! Well, I got the double shot in at least. Uh-oh. Ah, crap. I'm stuck. There we go. Alright, well, I'm pretty sure I got his gun. I did. Doesn't mean he's not dangerous anymore, but he's slightly less dangerous. <laughs> Oh, I ran into his mine or whatever. There we go. Once he's frozen, it should be game over for him. Whoops, if I could actually aim. What was that? Two completely missed shots. Oh my god. I need more practice at the range. Oh, bad. Oh my god, what is going on? I'm like shooting all over the place. Oh well, it was ugly, but he's dead. Uh, let's see. I did leave some health lying around. I'll tuck that away. So this thing will improve my spear, huh? Okay, talk to Kamut. Back down to Song's Edge. Maria said to find her friend, the rock painter. Seems paintings mean a lot to the Banuka.
Is this what you- Hush, hush. A shaman's secrets are not spoken aloud. Is this what you wanted me to find? Bind it to your spear. Use it to attach this for now. You'll find more, I'm sure. Why are you helping me? The blue light is fading. The machine songs are ending, and, and what does the conclave do? They sit, they chant, they observe. No more. We must fight for it. And you? You are a fighter. We share a cause. I'm not sure we do. I'm not even sure what the cause is. But I'm grateful. No need for thanks. Only action. Now I can attach modification parts to my spear. Works for me. Might as well get started improving my spear. Your spear now has slots for modification items. Press the touchpad to do that. <laughs> I went way too quick to read. Um, so anyways, not a problem. I know what to do. We're gonna go over to uh, crafting. There's a Silence Lance. You can see it now has two modification slots. Before we do that, though, we need to open up my treasure boxes because at least the one he gave me has a spear damage coil. So now we go over to crafting. And we actually have two spear damage coils. So we get 17% spear damage there and 16% there. And that gets me the trophy first spear modification. And we're still sitting on one skill point. Can't get anything with that. Although I'm almost level 52. Just a little bit further. Uh, and yeah, I think we're all good here. Alright. We are done. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.